What's going on YouTube? It is the eve of Christmas Eve tonight and for you I'm going to be opening a Christmas special for Throwback Thursday 2007 Bowman Chrome. So I just got back from eating some fantastic pho and I'll show a picture on the screen so y'all can indulge. And tonight I wanted to get into this Bowman Chrome box. I bought it Black Friday special at Steel City's Collectibles. And there's a few cards I'm going to chase in there. Most notably, basically anything with Freddie Freeman's name on it out of this box will be a, considered a success for my purposes anyway. So a little bit about the product. Um, 2007 Bowman Chrome baseball cards. And there are 24 packs. Three cards per pack. There are some Tim Lincecum rookie cards. Freddie Freeman, obviously. Wouldn't be his rookie card, but it would be a prospect card. And a handful of other goodies. I don't believe this set has anything guaranteed in terms of autographs. But there are obviously chances to find them. With that said, I've got the knife ready. Let's break the seal and see what's inside. Hope everybody's having a great Christmas Eve. Whether you're traveling, staying home, or uh, both. <laughs> I hope uh, everything's going well and everybody's staying safe out there. We have officially broken the seal. These packs, once upon a time, were $2.99 a piece. I actually paid less than that. If you consider that there are 24 packs in here, 24 times $2.99 would be somewhere around $70, a little less than that. And I paid $65 for it. So I'm going to open, go ahead and open the first pack so we can take a look to see what these look like. And then I'm going to do probably a handful at a time to run through them a little faster. So the first card we've got is a Scott Olson. We have a Christopher Cody and a Ryan Braun rookie card. Now I don't know a whole lot about these, so I don't know why some cards are green, some cards are blue, and some cards are red. I suppose over the course of this box, I will figure that out. There's the Ryan Braun rookie card, Bowman Chrome. And that's what the back looks like. So the blue, I was thinking it could be a parallel. Um, BC 173, so the number on this card is different than the others. This doesn't have the BC prefix. All right, so it looks like the BC indicates that it is a prospect card. So as I mentioned, I'm gonna open a handful of these at a time. So we've got 23 packs left. I'm gonna go ahead and open three. And we will see what we find. Those interested here are the odds. Par refractor parallels are one and six. Speaking of refractors, there's one here, Carlos Delgado. We've got a Emerson Frostad prospect card. We've got a Josh Fields rookie card. Melky Cabrera. It's an impressive signature there by Melky. Gregory Porter. David De Jesus. We've got a Brett Myers. 
prism refractor of some kind. X-fractor -fra card. This one's numbered out of 250. Jordan Smith and Francisco Liriano. All right, so the next three packs. Let's go ahead and take a look. We've got a Hunter Pence rookie card. Jim Fasano. Raul Ibanez. We have a Kenny Rogers blue refractor parallel. Carlos Leon. We have a Ryan Sweeney rookie card. A Ramon Hernandez. Matt Young. And Ted Lilly. Remember when Ted Lilly was coming up? I recall him being a significant prospect. I haven't heard much about him in a long time. I'm not sure what he's been up to or how long he was in the majors. <clears throat> All right, our next three packs. We've got a Jose Reyes when he was still with the Mets. Chris Nowak. Mike Mussina. Philip Humber, rookie card. Ryan Norwood. Adam Dunn. Javier Vasquez with the White Sox at the time. Chris Salamita and Miguel Tejada. See Johnny Damon on the back. That could possibly be a rookie card. I'm not sure when he came into the league. I think it might have been earlier than 2007. Actually, it definitely was. Now that I think about it. Uh, Randy Wolf. Carl Gelnius. There's Johnny Damon. It is not a rookie card. Yeah, he had played in 1,700 games at this point. He was drafted by the Royals in 1992. So yeah, this most definitely was not his rookie card. <laughs> Pat Burrell. We have a Ronald Prettyman. Michael Barrett. Rory Halliday. I don't... I was about to say, I don't ever, ever remember him in a Rays uniform. It says Jays, not Rays. Yeah, Blue Jays makes a lot more sense. He played for the Blue Jays. He played for the Phillies. Maybe a couple other teams. Jason Schmidt and a checklist. That's it for that pack. Still missing out on the Tim Lincecum rookie card we're looking for. And anything with Freddie Freeman's name on it. Hopefully somewhere in this box. Next nine cards, David Wright, Henry Sosa autograph. So this is a first Bowman card, certified autograph issue, Henry Sosa. Unfortunately, I have no earthly idea who Henry Sosa is. And if he ever did anything. With that said, there is our first hit out of the box. That's the type of card we were looking for out of Freeman. It was a prospect card with an autograph on it. There's Henry Rodriguez, Jeff Francis, Mike Lowell, Chris Carter, and Kenji Johima.
Next three packs. It's actually going to be a fairly quick rip as we have a high volume of packs but a low volume of cards. Only 72 cards in this box, so it's not going to take a terrible really long amount of time to go through them. And I love chrome cards. Bowman Chrome, Tops, Tops Chrome, I, I really, really enjoy the aesthetics of them. First card is going to be a Tory Hunter Refractor. It is not numbered. Steve Singleton, Jared Weaver, Checklist, Derek Lowe, he was with the Dodgers, Ole Sheldon, Kenny Rogers, Jeff Weaver, Hatch, Anthony Hatch, and Kevin Millwood. All right, we've got five left. I'm going to go ahead and rip all of these, and we will do a send-off with 15 cards instead of nine. Wish me luck. Hopefully we get the Lincecum rookie, the Freddie Freeman prospect card. Barry Bonds has a card or two in here. Um, so there's a few. The auto or the Ryan Braun rookie card might be the best pull of the pack so far. This Henry Sosa's first Bowman card, which is really, really cool. I just unfortunately don't think he had a huge impact in the majors. Well, I know what five of the cards are, and I know that none of them are Lensicum or Freeman. Our first card is Jose Vidro. We've got Patrick Riley, Carlos Guillen, Tori Hunter, Brendan Caton, Jimmy Rollins, Josh Hamilton rookie card. What he could have been had he not, you know, had the injury bug and gotten busted for PEDs at least once. I also did not realize he was a red. I always remember him as being a ranger, but that's a pretty cool rookie card to have. Grant Somas, Aubrey Huff. Behind the checklist, we have another Josh Hamilton rookie card. This one is not a refractor and is also not numbered. Joe Mather, Freddie Sanchez, Michael Young, Joe Ness, and Troy Tolowitzki rookie card. Also, what could have been, had he just not stayed healthy, um, he could have gone down as one of the best, you know, top 10 or so shortstops of all time. So that is going to end it for this video. We got a couple really cool rookie cards of players that could have been a lot more than what they are now. With that said, this was a very fun and cool box to rip. Unfortunately, we didn't nail the Freeman or the Lincecum we were after, but I still enjoyed, you know, opening this for y'all, and I'm sure some of you have never seen this product before. I had never seen it. I just knew what was in it, and I picked it up. So anyway, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Have a Merry Christmas.